the Brain Mapping Society and Chopra Foundation collaborate on many, many initiatives. And uh, we are, our foundation is very involved in public awareness of science, technology, brain, mind, healing initiatives. So brain mapping today is such a profound and intricate science that there's no experience that you cannot map. No thought, no emotion, no feeling, no perception that cannot be mapped. These are called brain correlates of experience. Once you know them, you can target treatment very specifically. So that's the main interest that we have to create new technologies for treatment of disease, diagnosis of disease. But my interest also is in the relationship between what we call the mind, consciousness, and the physical body and the universe, and what is called the hard problem of consciousness. So we are exploring that with them. What's so important to bring all these minds into one place at the same time, exchanging those kind of different ideas? Right? When you have maximum diversity of opinion, education, insight, inspiration, maximum diversity of talent. When you have an open system, when you have total transparency and feedback, shared vision and people are connected, then you have the possibility of doing science in a way that was never done before. You know, all the past science that we think of, you know, Einstein, Newton, Anybody, we give, we attribute one scientist to major discoveries. Today, that has accelerated because science has become a collective effort. That's why we are here. Thank you so much for being.